Hey everybody, uh, today I wanted to talk to you about what's going on with uh, Ripple and the price movement. It recently increased about 20%. Um, it's settling at about 30 cents right now, but uh, while well, the entire crypto market's been, uh, you know, pretty steadily going down about a uh, half a percent a day the past week or a uh, you know, quarter percent a day the past um, week or so, um, all of a sudden there was an, uh, an announcement and uh, Ripple or XRP, uh, the price shot up. And so I kind of wanted to talk about this because it's kind of confusing what's going on. So. Okay, so um, Ripple's head of regulatory relations for Asia Pacific and the Middle East uh, suggested that the company's liquidity solution, XRapid, was going to go live as early as next month. Now, he was on stage with um, the CEO of Swift, and Swift also announced that it was doing a partnership with R3, not Ripple. Um, even though Ripple and R3 do have a partnership, uh, that news ended up taking place, and that's what ended up increasing the, the spike. So uh, there has been a rumors going on that Swift was going to be doing partnerships with Ripple, but they were going to do a middleman, uh, essentially a company called R3. And the interesting thing about that is R3 and Ripple have had uh, disagreements in the past they've been in lawsuits in fact they uh, at the end of 2017 they got into a lawsuit uh, over a billion uh, XRP that was purchased and uh, it was it was it was for 0 0.008 pennies or something like that and you know XRP ended up increasing to a couple bucks so that could have been a big problem if they if they said you know hey pay us but at the end of 2017 near the end or middle Q3 Q3 around August I think it was uh, Ripple ended up uh, saying our, to R3 that their partnership was dissolved because R3 wasn't living up to their expectations so R3 countersued and there's been a long uh, battle now there was an agreement that took place behind ba back doors essentially stating that I mean no one knows really what took place but I'm assuming what took place was Ripple said uh, hey we're not gonna give you that much XRP but we'll, we'll, we'll give you this amount of XRP um, at any rate, the partnership uh, ended up continuing. Uh, they ended up saying that they put all that stuff behind them, and now you hear that uh, S that Swift is partnering with uh, R3. Now, what R3 means to Ripple is, or to XRP rather, it's hard to <laughs> people get so mad when you call XRP Ripple, but I'm I'm not going to go into that. So XRP um, is essentially, so XRP's vision is they just want to distribute XRP to all these banks in the world. And that way when you want to transfer money, you're just going to be transferring Ripple and it'll be instantaneous and super cheap. And that way it won't have to take one to three days and, and uh, the fees can be much less um, or much more man manageable for consumers and the banks can make more profits off of uh, off of the fees so that's what they want to do however uh, banks don't want to hold a bunch of XRP because uh, it's volatile I mean it was you know a couple bucks last year now it's you know down to you know 30 cents uh, I mean just this little news story bumped it up 20% in a day so um, banks just don't want to you know hold a bunch of XRP that is so volatile and uh, until the market's stable and I think that's a lot of you know big businesses concerns uh, when it comes to holding a bunch of cryptocurrency and that's understandable um, so Ripple's solution to that was X rapid and they were just going to you know have these different exchanges and banks were going to use these exchanges and then it was going to be more expensive but still a lot cheaper um, that being said that's that's essentially what Swift is doing with R3. So now Swift is using R3. R3 is dealing with uh, Ripple, and uh, they are doing their transactions that way. So it's still big news for Ripple um, when it comes to now when it comes to you know their you know their success. 
Now, <clears throat> whether you know you agree with where Ripple's heading or not, uh, a lot of people don't like Ripple, and, and the problem is, is Bitcoin is a solution to get to get rid of the current financial problems and the and the financial markets. Uh, it, it solves a lot of problems um, currently when it comes to how the financial markets run currently. Uh, Ripple is just a band-aid. Um, it fixes a portion of it, but it still is. It's integrated into the current systems, um, and it doesn't fix the current systems. And I think that's what a lot of people's problems are. I mean, it does fix a lot of problems, and Ripple, and that's why I think Ripple will, will be a success. Because in the short term, yeah, and who knows if Bitcoin really succeeds or not. I mean, I think it will, and I'm I'm all in. But, um, but you know, who, who knows? People could not take on to it, and it could just keep doing this, and people could just, you know, never want to go in, and always think it's a bubble. It's you know, whatever. I mean, I mean, I to me, it's like cool. Bubble has bursted, you know, five times. And it's gonna happen six times, seven times, eight times. If it continues happening that way, that would be awesome, right? Just write it to the top, and now we know, you know, hey, if Bitcoin goes up to eighty thousand dollars and it starts, you know, dropping down to seventy, seventy-five, seventy, all, you know, I may end up pulling out and waiting till it levels out. And if it levels out at, you know, thirty k or twenty k or something like that, then I'll go back all in, and, you know, uh, you know. At any rate, um, you know, you do you. Obviously, I'm. I don't know what I'm talking about when it comes to investing. Uh, I just love cryptocurrency. But I just wanted to let you know, kind of where my head was at, and kind of what the, you know, what the uh, X Rapid and um, the Ripple connection with R3 and and Swift and everything was all about. So, um, yeah. So. I think it's big news for, for Ripple because Ripple is going to be used by Swift still, uh, just not directly. And uh, and yeah, I think anyone who holds Ripple is, is very happy right now because of that announcement. Um, at any rate, uh, that's it for me. Uh, thanks. Have a good one. See you. Bye. Uh, oh yeah, um, I guess I'm supposed to ask about liking and subscribing and smashing something. Um, I'll get used to it. Thanks. <laughs>